Particularly with um, Rick from you and John Favreau in the last season, I think they delivered some of the best episodes. episodes so I'm yes. very excited. And obviously, yes. <laughs> Rodriguez speaks for himself. Yeah, exactly. Apart from producing Predators. <laughs> no, you know what? We <laughs> no, did watch Predators. It was we right. did. Yeah. We, it's got some great ideas, Predators. It I does. So. I really like the idea that they get dropped off on an alien planet. I think and it's a fantastic like, idea. Yeah. Because it's cool because you get to take different killers from different parts of the world and different different styles of killer. Like you've got like the soldier and then you find out Tough Grace, Tough Grace is like a, a serial killer, isn't he? Yeah. And it's cool, it is cool. To, to mesh all those people together. He's got some really good ideas, isn't it? That's cool. Larry, so, Larry right? Fish as well. A, a team, oh, Larry oh, Fish. Boy. <laughs> absolute boy. He's, he's not enough. He, he's in it for... Even a, though he's in everything at the same time. I've never yeah. felt like he, he needs more like lead. I forget he's, he's in both um, Batman v Superman and Ant-Man and the Wasp. Oh yeah, he's completely wasted in two in, both Marvel, in two superhero cinematic universes. Why? Yeah, um, yeah no. My froze for a second there. Just my brain fired. You, you were like, "Do I go back to a, Mandalorian? Yeah, yeah. Do I go back to Predators or do I go back to Larry Fishburne?" <laughs> well, I mean, the Predators movie. I mean, the Predators movie. I think is better than the most recent one. One hundred percent. Yeah, one hundred percent. I remember when we saw it in the cinema. We were just like, "What <laughs> is this?" Going on? Shane Black joke. as well. How? Yeah, I just. It wasn't what it needed. I, I think the, the Predators, whilst it's kind of like a, ultimately a flawed film and it, it obviously didn't reboot the franchise, yeah. I think it's a step in the right direction to say, yes. let's go for a team of Predators, let's give you new Predators, let's let's give you Predators fighting each other and yeah. we can take you off into space and you know, give me the... Danny Trejo with two miniguns. Yeah. I mean, it sounds like the greatest movie of all time, like on paper. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? When you mention it, I'm like, should we watch it again? But we... Oscar winner Adrian Brody, <laughs> star of The Pianist in... Predators. <laughs> <laughs> I remember as a kid being so excited for it as well. Like the trailer. Yes. Yeah, Do I remember. remember being because well, no, but they did that bait and switch, didn't they? Where in the trailer, loads of the red dots went on Adrian Brody, and then oh, the film yeah. is just three red dots. I remember that pissed me off yeah. so much. I hate that shit. <laughs> yeah, you do. I'd rather you didn't like just only show me things yeah. that are actually going to be yeah. in the film, or at just, least that's that's things lot, that are it? not as cool. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Because if you're putting stuff in, like, like, you know that shot with the Hulk running in the first Avengers Infinity War trailer? Yeah. The, they're all running yeah, together. Yeah, yeah, Like, we didn't get that, did we, at all? I don't mind But I don't mind so it much. because what we got was awesome still. Do you know yes. what I'm saying? And also, it's like, that's kind of on purpose to say, like, oh, well, which characters are going to be in the third act? Which characters are going to be over here? Like, because there was so many characters to juggle, yeah. I think it's good for those sorts of trailers to kind of lead you down the garden path a little bit. But I think with something like that Predators trailer where, oh, oh all the red uh, sight lines have come up on Adrian Brody. There's going to be loads of Predators in it. It's like there was nothing even close to that scale in the film. So yeah. that's just setting you up for something that's going to be disappointing. Yes. Exactly. Whereas Infinity War, it's more like, oh. Throwing you for a loop, in it? Yeah, yeah, Hulk's yeah. not going to come out and save Banner. That, that yeah. was cool. That would have been the trailer. That's true. 